Hey guys, Russell here. Uh, sorry about the lighting in the background. I am at my friend Gina's house. I'm house sitting um, and dog sitting. So you may see a dog or two in the background. Um, they're under the table right now, so it should be fine. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to uh, get the review of the Lunatech Aquabot out of the way. Um, so this right here is the Lunatech Aquabot. Uh, this one has the strap uh, that is sold separately, but basically it's uh, an item that is made for water bottles that converts it into a pressurized sprayer. So the whole concept is you pump it uh, up and down. I think the instruction says six times, four, five, six times for a 32 ounce size Aquabot, which this is. Um, and you can press the button and essentially I guess it was depressurized. Essentially, it uh, squirts water. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, so that's the jet feature. If you unscrew the cap a little more um, or screw it in a little more, it does a mist feature. Um, and then if you take the cap off, uh, it uh, has a shower feature. Um, so the long story short, of how I acquired this is I had an LL Bean uh, LL Bean bag that was defective, and uh, as you guys know or should know, LL Bean uh, has or used to have um, a hundred percent guarantee. And when I returned it, um, they unfortunately had discon discontinued the bag that. I had so they gave me a store credit and uh, I had a ton of bags and I hadn't really used the bag that I was returning anyways in a long time so I looked on their website and I found this cool little thing um, as you guys know I am very big into gardening and when I first got this it um, reminded me a lot of those garden sprayers that you get at the garden store essentially it's the same concept except this is a water bottle that has a pressurized pump at the top, whereas a garden sprayer is made just for gardening. You're, you can't, I mean, I guess you could drink out of it, but I wouldn't. Um, but yeah, so I did some tests on this. I took it out on uh, one of our outings uh, with one of Gina's dogs and it works as advertised. Uh, you pump it, you spray. Uh, we used it to fill the dog's water bottle. Um, there are multiple functions that I can see this used for. So as you know, Travis and I do a lot of biking. Um, and uh, I feel like you could clean your bike off. You can spray yourself down if you're hot. Um, you can wash your hands if you get crap on it or your gear. Uh, there's multiple uses for it, um, and I opted to purchase the handle, uh, which is, I think, 10 bucks, 15 bucks extra, but basically you could put your hand around it and have an easier time spraying the, the bottle, um, and it's adjustable, so you can use it this way as well, um, but I just thought it was an added, cool added little function, and also there's a pocket here on... Um, the strap so if you do take it off to use the shower function you can store it in there and not lose it on the trail uh, but overall I really like it this is actually um, if I can find it if you can see right there this is actually a Nalgene brand bottle so this top can fit on any wide mouth bottle uh, Nalgene's especially uh, but I think that's really cool that they partnered with them because I'm a big Nalgene fan um, and I just think that that's really cool. So I feel like this is very well made. It's heavy duty. I feel like it could take a beating, um, but I'll continue to use it, take it on some bike rides, and then I will update you accordingly. Thank you so much for watching this review. Um, I hope it was helpful. If you guys have any questions, leave it in the comments below. I will be doing other reviews of items that uh, I have lying around and videos that I have been meaning to do. I've been getting back into the whole YouTube thing, so there's that. Um, but yeah, thank you so much, and please subscribe if you haven't yet. Bye.